hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's miss memory here and i'm back with a story this time so guys i know you are so so eager to know what the story is so don't forget to like this video don't forget to subscribe please share and also comment and and yeah please you must watch until the video is done please please don't just watch until three minutes and then you're gone please watch until the video is done so without wasting time let's get into the story and i have some wine so that the story is nicely juicy so we'll be sipping some wine <laughs> title let me tell you the story how I was exposed in my eighth grade imagine eighth grade and I was 13 yeah I was 13 by that time I was in my grade eight so that year 20 what year was it 2011 yeah 2011 I went to a new school by grade 8 so I was a newcomer at that school so goes first term I passed in my top five second term I passed in my top five and then third term and I was living with with my aunt so my aunt used to used to my aunt used to teach at that same school so let's name the aunt teacher A my aunt is teacher A. So, my aunt used to give me my phone. I used to have a phone. So, my aunt used to give me my phone on Fridays. And then I and then I use it Friday, Saturday. And then I give it back on Sunday. So, yeah. That was, that was how, I used to, how we used to do it the whole time. So, until that time in my third trimester, my aunt... Okay, I... Yes, my aunt gave me my phone on Friday, and then, and then I used it Friday, Saturday, and then Sunday. During the day, it went flat, man, and then I had to, to take it, to take it to my aunt's room, to go charge. So and then I didn't, I didn't take it anymore because it was a Sunday. I just, I just went there to go switch it off and then give it. I didn't take it anymore. So the whole time whole time i was thinking my phone was charging yes it was charging but teacher a the aunt was going through my phone through my messages oh <laughs> it was my first phone i'll even google that picture it was what well, it was like a samsung something those those old samsung i'll google the picture and then i'll insert it so whole time my aunt was even answering the calls and went through my messages so comes monday it was a monday so we went to, we were going to school we used to go we used to go with just a car we used to go with a car we didn't have a bus we didn't have a school bus so we used to go with a car like we used to be picked up by just one car like a lot of us man so so we went to school on monday we went to the assembly point yeah yeah and then the day went by and then comes the last period i think we had bis or or arts i don't know but we're just in the classroom i know it was not a promotional subject it was a non-promotional subject so we were just in the classroom seated waiting for the bell to ring so we go to our houses so it's for our registered class teacher to come in so my aunt is teacher A, right? Let's name our class teacher, teacher X. So teacher X came in the classroom and then he said maybe for five, six minutes and then he called me. Memory, follow me to the, to the office, to the staff room. Then I'm like, okay. And that time I was, 
I was a class captain, so I thought in my head I thought maybe he's going to send me something. I'm going to bring some some things to the classroom or yeah man class captain duties so yeah i went so me to enter the staff room i saw a cup phone that looks like mine and then i'm like okay maybe it's it's, ju it's just for the teachers it's not mine and then the teacher and then the teacher x Someone is distracting me. Yeah, as I was saying. And then teacher X, teacher X told me to go to the physics lab. Okay, I followed teacher X to the physics lab. He opened the he opened the, the lab and then and then when I just looked at the back it was teacher A coming and I'm like oh maybe it's just maybe she's just walking around the school because teacher A used to teach uh, the junior grades and then we entered the lab and then he was like you may have a seat in my head I'm like sit in the lab and you don't have class physics class or bio, uh, life science and like okay let me sit and then a few seconds is for for teacher a to come in with an angry face i'm like shit what did i do what did i do teacher x is my class class teacher and then this one teacher a is my aunt I'm like, okay, all right. And then three, two minutes, we'll name this one Teacher Y. Three, two minutes is Teacher Y coming in. Teacher Y was not related. Teacher Y used to teach uh, lower grades also. Teacher y, Teacher y with like a small book. Not really small, but it, it's an um, A5 book. Yes, A5, uh, yeah, A5 book. I'm like, okay. Then I was sit, I was sitting like facing them and then them then it was like a, like a whole interview thing and I'm like okay what is going on I said I kept quiet and then and then it's for teacher X to ask me um memory can you please is this your phone can you please tell us if this is your phone I'm like yes it looks like my phone it looks like my phone but i can only know if it if it's mine if i go through with the, like the contacts most or the messages and then he was like oh okay and then he started are you dating that too and yes we were dating but i i lied i said no we are not dating and then he asked are you sure? <laughs> and I'm like, we used to date, but we broke up. We broke up. But we were dating. Then I said, we broke up. And then he was like, oh, okay. And then I was like, okay. Uh, I can see in this phone, there are some messages. Then my heart was... There are some messages. I'm like, mm hmm. Okay. Are you dating who 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 another guy's name? I'm like, no. Are you dating who who who? I'm like, no. Are you dating who who who? Like, different names. I'm like, no. Okay. And, and then those are those are the guys who were proposing. They were shooting their shots. I'm like, how did they know? Anna come teacher A was just answering the calls when I put my phone on the charger pretending to be like the innocent me <laughs> <laughs> guys I was doomed so after that and then teacher A was just looking at me with an angry face 
I'm like, oof, I. And then in my head, I was like, <laughs> it's just you that brought all these things to school. We could have just sat at home and just discussed this thing. <laughs> and then teacher Y, we take a book. Okay, my girl, you must you must mention everyone that is dating in this school. So he was there threatening Kucha. I must say everyone's name that I know is dating. Otherwise, I and now the like boyfriend that time. I don't want to mention the I want to mention X, but yeah, that time. Otherwise, we will be called on Friday because we had we, we used to have um, devotions on on Mondays and Fridays. Otherwise, on Fridays we will be called in front and then they will celebrate they'll they'll celebrate a wedding so apparently we'll get married on friday i'm like yo i know i'm not ready to get married on friday so me i just mentioned anyone i mentioned all my friends who who is the thing who who and then teacher when was it down who 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 okay who 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 next everyone that came on my mind and i know they were dating i i said their names I was not even sure. I was like, no, who who and who 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 and who who and who who and who who, and then the bell rang. So we were not done, huh? So, 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 so. The chawai told me, okay, all these people we are going to call them, and then we will celebrate your weddings on Friday. <laughs> Okay, my heart was like, yo, what? On Friday I'm getting married? No man. And then and then on and then we went home. And then when I went home, my head was spinning because I used to go first, then teacher A. Because the teacher A used to have those meetings or just staying at school most for I don't know. So I went home. I had my own keys. So I went home. When I went home, I removed my uniform and then I sat outside crying. I'm like, yo, what is this that went to school? It's not that I used to perform bad. It's not that I used I used to, to pass in my top fives, but yo, teacher A hey, really? <laughs> okay. An hour later is for me to see teacher A coming from the gate. I'm like yo what am i going to do how am i going to look how i'm not even ready i'm <laughs> that time i stopped crying but i was thinking ah, uh -uh, i deserve no life imagine i was just 13 and i'm thinking of ah, uh -uh, maybe i must just kill myself <laughs> no guys it was ah, uh -uh, it was horrible that day that monday went it was really a blue monday after all so so that Monday passed. Okay, when my aunt came, she pretended as if everything was fine. Everything was fine. Oh, how are you? And those things. And then me, I, I also pretended as if, yeah, everything is fine. Okay, is to go to school on Tuesday. Everyone is just every every learner is just doing about memory. Went to the physics lab and and said our names what what i'm like who told these people now <laughs> yo i was in cack mm -hmm. so if if we had a school magazine i would have been the the cover page or my picture would have been on that cover page of the of the school ma magazine but luckily we did not have but i was the center of attraction when i was going to the toilet if i just Passed by a learner or even a teacher, I'm like, whoa, what is what is now he or she saying about me? I'm like, whoa, everyone was just looking at me. I'm like, oh, no man. And then during the course of the week, teacher Y with like a book called everyone to his classroom, to his classroom. So teacher Y was asking because I've mentioned mentioned some names was so teacher if, if i mentioned memory with who 
hiyo na call huhu to can say other people so it went on like that tuesday wednesday thursday friday <laughs> and when i when i went to school me i was like no even when i'm in the classroom even in those oh, even when the teachers were teaching i'm like yo and this more in what what is happening to my life <laughs> happening to my life so yeah it went by until thursday until thursday and then i was kind of fine on thursday and then to think of friday's morning devotion again Ooh, uh -uh. so so on friday in the morning as before i went to school i was thinking what if i just get sick what if i just die today what so i wanted i wanted to die that day because i was not ready to go get married <laughs> so that friday i was thinking oh, what if i just fake being sick or something and then i'll tell my aunt that i'm sick but no because she knows about the story she will not let me be home so i was like okay never mind let's just face this and then i went to school and then we went to the assembly point and then now teacher why teacher why and then teacher why teacher why no at first we used to sing like yes we used to sing and then pray and then now the announcements and those things and then when the announcement part came my heart was boom boom so i was like yo this teacher and then teacher why went on the on the on the what podium yeah and i was like no i want to to talk about love affairs all right I was just facing down and everyone was just like mm, this is memory's cause so uh teacher why spoke about love affairs what what so you you people are just love love what, what you're not even concentrating on your education anymore what what it was not even that boyfriend girlfriend thing of lovey dovey things it was oh, it was just children things man those things of bringing each other sweets those things of oh, it was not a lovey dovey thing not even sexually active so yeah he addresses the love affair thing issue and yeah i will not say it was unnecessary but it was just too much it was too much so i felt like i was exposed man like teacher a could have just sat with the kid who is me at home because i know if i was a parent and just find out like that my kid is doing that i'll just sit with the child and just talk to the child instead of taking the, the whole story to school <laughs> now everyone even the kids at lower grades new memory new memory <laughs> So from there, it's like I became a celebrity. <laughs> ah, ah, guys, no. I was exposed. Uh, I was exposed in my eighth grade. So yeah, that's how the story went. And after that, because I lied. I lied at first that we broke up, right? After that, I went to to homeboy and told him that no it's over i do not want these things anymore so we broke up after that actually it was just after that monday i think we broke up on a tuesday or wednesday somewhere there we broke up i told him that i don't want anymore i don't want these stories to go far i do not want so it's just better for us to <clears throat> to break up but I was, I was, guys, I was behaving, I was passing, I was the class captain, but 
again i had to go through this i was exposed <laughs> yo guys i cried i went through i was like no i deserve no life because i just i just don't find it i didn't find it funny until now i think about it and i'm like oh, what was the use what was the reason of now bringing the whole story to school if we're just supposed to to find a solution at home no mm -mm. no but yeah i learned something from it i learned that you must not have a boyfriend while you are a child but well, we were told all the, the consequences of having a boyfriend and what 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 getting pregnant those things i don't know if if you have a boyfriend you just automatically be pregnant or something i don't know but with all those things yeah so that was the whole story and yeah about about my parents they were also told so i was thinking kucha yo what if this thing goes until my parents my mom now so my mom was told and my mom called me and she was like no it's really wrong those it's not nice oh, you're still young what was it? and i was crying when my mom was telling me all those things yeah i was advised not to do it and when i went when i went home for a weekend did i go home? no i went to my other aunt in okahau so that aunt the first thing when when she saw me she was like no you are just at school with boyfriends I'm like <laughs> <laughs> so this story came until here oh yo i was doomed and then yeah life went on life went on and then like no the, the the thing is i was not getting why teacher a took the story to school because come on i was performing good i was always in my top five it's not that i was always failing and then now maybe it's the cause of the failure guys no yo i know anywho that is my story i just thought of sharing it with you guys because like you understand you get <laughs> i was like no how do you how do you do that how so yeah if you like my story please give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe why are you not watching if you're not subscribing don't forget to subscribe please share please comment and also you must also tell me the the type of stories or the type of videos you want to you want me to upload or you want me to do so that we keep the channel growing you know yeah so also tell me comment down below how 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 do you how do you take it was it really necessary for teacher a to take the story to school if it was then to me it was not necessary because i know please comment if you like this video thumbs up thumbs up share comment and also hit the notification bell so that you get notified when i upload a video you know you get mm -hmm. so with that said ciao see you in my next video